Oh, back up! Oh, that spin! Pretty, oh so pretty. I feel pretty and witty and gay and I pity. Stay with me. Please don't say more stairs. It's the most beautiful place I've ever seen. Ah, so bright. Ah! Uh, uh, really? That's my body, Axel. My broken, battered Hold body. On a second. <laughs> It's not your day. The ground is almost squishy, like carpet. Looks funny, too. Hey, I can... What in the... It's made of wool. This tree, the grass, it's... It's all wool. You're telling me that we've been resting all our hopes on this guy, and the whole time he's been building some totally artificial happy land? Well, it's real wool. It's real evidence that Soren is whacked. Isn't it pretty impressive that he built an exact replica out of this stuff? Impressively yeah. banana pants. Banana pants? What? We came here for nothing. Is this not a bit longer what than are you usual? To do now. Hey Lucas, you okay, man? Just look around, Jesse! If the greatest builder of all time has spent years working on this, what are the chances he's even gonna have that bomb, huh? I've had enough crazy for one day. What's his problem? He seems pretty upset. Maybe he's allergic to wool. Just give him some space. He'll be okay. Oh, so... We don't get time for people being drama queen. Hey, Petra. So on a scale of uh to uh, how bad are you feeling? Somewhere in between, but I'm holding on for now. Okay. This place is crazy. Have you ever seen anything weirder than this place? Actually, yeah. Really? I once saw a villager dig a huge trench and fill it with like a million carrots. That was Bugs Bunny, wasn't it? You never know. Who else loved carrots that much? Do you think Soren managed to get out of here without leaving any clues behind? He is the greatest builder of all time. If anybody knew how to put in the secretest of secret doors, it's him. So I'm probably looking for... Well, to open a secret door, you need a secret mechanism. I guess I'm gonna keep looking around. Look away. Okay, let's check on Axel and Olivia. I just remember their name. Thought you could trick me, huh, fake son? Well, it's not gonna work. It did for a second. What's up, Jesse? Either of you guys know what's eating Lucas? Well, as a longtime observer of human behavior. We have no idea. Try, you know, talking to him. Yeah, because that always works. You both doing okay? Could be worse. Could be better. Found anything interesting? Just that button. Doesn't really seem to do anything, though. Did you push it? You should have pushed it. Around. Right. Oh, that... My pig is way over there. 
Hey, Reuben. What? Reuben, you give me that? How many times have I saved you, Reuben? You're gonna give me that look? You are an ungrateful pig. It was an accident. Well, at least that's not made of wool. Must be all sorts of hidden water systems in this place. How did I get there? Ruben, you're gonna treat me like that? I rubbed your belly, man! What do you want? Petra's worried about you. Listen, I know I've been prickly, okay? But... Jesse, I think something's wrong. With Petra. I mean, you have to have noticed. The lack of energy. The labored breathing. What exactly are you saying, Lucas? There's something wrong. Okay, something big. He kind of seems like he already it's knows. not fooling anybody. That is true. At least not me. Look, Lucas, Petra's sick. Yeah. It's kind of really no, obvious. No. A while, but she asked me not to say anything. The wither infected her with something. So everything I was worried about is true. Yeah. This is my fault, Jesse. Petra's wither sickness, it's because of me. Your There's no way this is because of you. If I hadn't choked, you would have been able to pull Petra out of that tractor beam sooner. For all we know, Petra didn't get sick until way after that. That is true. Maybe you're right. She was she was at the at the um nether. If one of place. our best fighters is sick. Do we even stand a chance anymore? Not like we haven't dealt with some grade A problems before, but I just can't help feeling kind of hopeless. If we so, stick together, we can do anything. Even something that feels impossible. It just feels extra impossible now. Then we stick together extra hard. Okay. I just kind of wish Petra would tell everybody. It would just make things easier. That is true. Hey, Jesse. How are you holding up? I'm not the one you need to worry about. You haven't found a way out of here, have you? Honestly, I haven't even been looking. I just... I just need a little alone time right now. You know what? Never mind. My pig ain't talking to me. That's how we live. That's how we live, pig. Okay, fine. Next time I won't save you from a herd of zombies. They're gonna feast on your bacon. Where's my time? I rubbed your belly. <laughs> Neat. Lucas knows something. How much of something? He sees you're not feeling well. I'm trying to hide it as best I can, but... You take care of you. I'll take care of Lucas. I'll be back. I'll be here. If you're sick, you're sick. You need to tell everyone, because... I mean... I can understand why she doesn't want to tell everyone about it because she feels like she might drag everyone down. But the reality is, 
you can't hide it. They already know and they're already gonna and they're already worried about you. So just tell them. Hey Jesse. You know what? Never mind. Wrong thing to say. Hey Jesse. Hey Jesse. Uh, kind of need to get at that lever you're blocking. Okay. Thanks. Yep. You're going. You're not gonna talk to me, Ruben. That's fine. That's fine. Be his pig. I don't care. There's a hundred pigs better than you. You know what? I'm gonna get a dog. They can fight. They, they can fight better than you can. I just had one mistake. Huh, didn't do anything. Is there another lever somewhere? It's, uh, cute, I guess. Oh, there it is. Way over there. You thought you could escape me, but you can't. Cause I'm a Minecrafter. Cool. Everybody, look how awesome I am. I ain't listening. I'm pushing the button. Forget listening. Don't tell me what to do. That's weird. Is it Jesse? Is it? Hey Don't everyone, I think I else? found Soren's way out! Why are you angry? Way to go, Jesse. That's awesome. Nice sleuthing, Jesse. Sorry I wasn't more help back there. When I think back to how I ran all over Endercon looking for Ivor, or when I got that skull... I'm just happy you're with us. We'll check out the rest of the house. See if we can find Soren before he finds us. Okay. So yeah, guys, that was well the playthrough, my first playthrough. I've been playing for five, four minutes now. So yeah, it's pretty cool. I mean, they literally just. Rule you into a fight scene or battle or whatever. It was pretty cool the way they always show um show who created the title and everything. But yeah, guys. Before I go, I want to remind you about that skit. Check it out right now. It's in the description. It's called it's called Betaholic. You're gonna like it. Trust me. Just check it out. You're not gonna regret it. If you do. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But yeah, guys, that was Minecraft Story Mode Episode Three. If you enjoyed it, please be sure to give me a like. If you want to, if you want to see more and you're new, please be sure to subscribe. Check out the playlist, and I'll see you in the next. Later.